The thing that does cut through and helps us reach new people uh, more than anything else are what we call sort of super videos. Change My Mind is obviously right. within yeah. the last three or four years. And then a subsidiary of that, Crowder Confronts, which usually occurred yeah. because someone threatened to kill me at a Change My Mind. But let's go uh, right now to a montage of actually uh, top moments from funded by you on location, super videos. We've got to make them afraid of somebody. Hey, kids. <laughs> When we say a billion views in this channel, like I said, it's closer to two if you add up Mug Club, the rest of it. This is with one piece of content on YouTube per day. It's not like That's, a lot of these other networks yeah. that are doing 50 pieces or 30 pieces. And yeah. like, this is, we're, 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 it's incredible. We are so grateful. Yeah. Um, and a big part of this, we will say that bring, the, the big part that uh, brings in the most amount of new subscribers here on YouTube because, you know, search results we've talked about, a lot of these algorithms aren't necessarily favorable to us. We've had a lot of problems That's running nice our videos as it. ads. Yeah. <laughs> well, the problem is like, how do we reach new audiences? Right. Like, well, yeah. people search, Stephen Crowder changed my mind for the longest Doesn't time. Come up. Fixed. Didn't, didn't show up. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. And then we were no longer able to like run videos as ads. So it's just right. like, how how do you reach new people? Uh, the thing that does cut through and helps us reach new people uh, more than anything else are what we call sort of super videos. And these are videos where we go on location, like Antifa we've talked about. Yep. Um, and there are two two really ones that stick out. Change My Mind is obviously right. within yeah. the last three or four years. And then a subsidiary of that, Crowder Confronts, which usually occurred yeah. because someone threatened to kill me at a Change My Mind. Yeah. Right. <laughs> yeah. So it's you two didn't start the fight. For one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> The Steven. Um, so, uh, but these super videos, what often happens is they go viral. They sort of become a news story as opposed to yeah. commenting on the news. You know, they became a news story in and of themselves. And that ultimately leads to more people subscribing to the channel. And here's the thing. I appreciate how much uh, everyone out there understands is sometimes if you join Mug Club, we'll have like a week where we maybe miss two shows or something. Right, because yeah. so usually we'll pre-tape, uh, but sometimes we can't. We just have to run and go do a hidden camera deal right. where we don't have 140-something uh, writers or staff like yeah. Jay Leno has or 100-something like Seth Meyers have. We, we have 12 people here, and I think 15 if yeah. you count part-timers abroad. And so we just have to pack up everything, go out, and tape a super video where we can't do this show and that. And we would never be able to afford to do these super videos if not for you. I mean, to give you an idea, yeah. doing like the Change My Mind you'll see in front of the White House, that's yeah. getting 12 yeah. people to Washington, D.C., mm. uh, several hundred pounds of equipment, making sure that we have security when we get there, mm -hmm. getting travel back, not to mention the editing software, food, hotel, typically for two days. I mean, you're talking about tens of thousands of dollars often to do these. And um, we wouldn't be able to do it if not for Mug Club. And I know it's one of those things that sometimes you don't see because these go up on YouTube, but Mug Club is paying for that. It's paying for us yeah. to reach new people because that cuts through the algorithms. And I can't thank you enough. We've actually shot a few that are in the hopper and we're planning mm. on doing more of these in the coming uh, coming year. Coronavirus has made it a little bit tough. You know what I'm talking bit, yeah. about, Bill. Yikes. Uh, but <laughs> no more China trip. Uh, let's go uh, right now to a montage of actually uh, top moments from funded by you on location, super videos. Thanks again so much. Hi, my name is Steven Crowder. He will not divide us. He will not divide us. He will not divide us. Okay, this is not a bad line. Okay. This is what he does. We're gonna brush it. And then you know bullshit. What do you think would happen if we went into a Muslim bakery and asked for a gay wedding cake? You can write on it, Ben loves yeah, Stephen yeah, forever, yeah, yeah. and have our hands yeah. maybe holding. No. Can I get a gun here without a background check? <laughs> I thought at gun shows you didn't have to do a background check. Oh no, 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 no. What you're asking is for somebody to commit a felony. Was it because of the magazine capacity? No, look at it. Yeah, it does look really sinister. Would you be on board with common sense gun reform? Depends on what that means. Do you own any firearms? Shotgun. Well, sorry. <laughs> Welcome to Detroit. We have a nice two-story in the Detroit area. Cozy. Rustic. You guys have papers? I need papers. He's gonna call ice, you motherfuckers. Wait till these hobos get a load of me. The price of my walls, not a price that you're willing to pay. Yes, bitch, yes, bitch, yes, bitch, slay. Are you familiar with the term manspreading? We'll see what women think. Using our homemade apparatus. I get why men sit like this. Yeah? I, I'm not shocked by it. <laughs> I 
I've decided to go through the socialized Canadian healthcare system to show you exactly what it's really like. What this does that triage. mean? That means we wait and we get judged by the nurse to decide how important we are. But there's a private clinic. Would you like to pay? Wait, hold up. A government employee recommending a private clinic? We've been tracking Anthony for a long time. He was just down there at President's Circle and they were handing out sharp objects to stab people with, said they had someone coming with an AK. Why did it take two late night hosts, comedians, to find this out? We took a hidden camera to an abortion clinic in Colorado where late-term abortions have been legal for years to show you exactly what it is that they, we, and you are talking about. This woman was going to end her 32-week, that's eight months, her eight-month-old baby's life. Hi, I'm Stephanie with all the frequencies of the feminism. <laughs> Hold on your pussy. I'm Stephanie and I'm pretty sure I'm pregnant. So your test came back positive. Really? We wanted to talk with someone about, about plan B. Yeah. Nice mugs, man. Louder, louder with Prado, man. Sh shout out to them, man. You need to call security. You're gonna have to leave. Well, I think that it's time to go. Okay. Um, because people are triggered. Got it. Hey YouTube, what you're about to watch is a new segment we call Change My Mind. Pretty simple, uh, we go out and set up in public and uh, pick a topic and we actually allow people from other points of view to come up and proactively change my mind. You are more than welcome to change my mind if you think I'm wrong. I am open to having my mind changed. Fetus is literally a parasite, like it is sucking the life from a mother. Yeah. Every single day, like that's literally what happens, that's not even like... Not a mother, I'm yeah, guessing. Like... <laughs> Would you be willing to maybe in a follow-up, we could do a segment on this, go with me to arrange, shoot for the first time, and purchase a, and yeah, purchase I'm a firearm? Down. Yeah, I'm, I'm down. Good. Hey, right on target. You okay? Yeah. We grab hands. Is that okay? Connect. You gotta con connect, connect, connect it over there. All right. You change me. Okay. All right. Look. All right. Look. This way it's going. There it is. What? There it is. What? All the way around. Look at this. How about that? Look at this. All different races, genders, the power of dance. That's of course, there are always those who aren't so excited to see us. I think you're a bigot, Darren. Oh. I think y'all are racist. Steven Crowder. Y'all. I would probably punch him if I saw him. You're a white bitch. Whiteness is a cancer and parasitic to society. All would. We're helping it. They get away with it on this motherfucking campus! Really? Yes, they fucking do! If nobody invited him here, can we ask him to leave this campus? Is this being handled? Shut the up! Hey, you Jesus Christ, ladies and gentlemen! Yeah! That's right from me! Jesus Christ! Eat my butt! Did I come to that? No! No! Men need to respect women! Period! So you should respect women? Um, I'm, I'm sorry. sorry, I am a woman, so f*** you! White people are cancer. Bye. We want to sit down with people in an ideal scenario and be able to exchange ideas, but when they don't want to, and they're acting like little spoiled brats slash domestic terrorists, we've got to make them afraid of somebody. Hey, kid. Yeah. Ah, I didn't you want a piece of me for a long time. Go f*** yourself, you piece of Hey, how are you, man? 
Steven Crowder, what's going on? We can discuss it at a neutral meeting place. I'm not discussing with people who have made threats against my son and his father who made threats against my son. When you threaten violence against someone, like, part of being a man is taking ownership of your actions, taking responsibility. And you said you didn't even post this and acted like you didn't know me. I think you're a liar. What did you mean by that? Was it like what you meant with killing members of ICE for five hundred dollars a pop? I don't look like that. Why would you want to light me on fire? I never said this. Yeah, you did. It's like I'm in bizarro land of lies. If you enjoyed this video. You can subscribe or hit the notification bell in one of these buttons or watch another video. Um, but, you know, this, the, the thing is you don't, um, I mean, you don't, you don't have to. Uh, I mean, I, I, I'd like it if you did. You know, you know, put a lot of effort into it. And, you know, whatever you want.